Hello and welcome back to Hobby Gamecraft. Minecraft Dungeons just dropped its newest DLC, Echoing Void. So in honor of that, I've made my favorite new Enderling, the Blastling. what he looks like with all the supports on. Start by uh, removing everything. We don't want just that there. All right.
All right, I'm gonna finish this up and uh, come back when it's time to start painting. All right, we're back after uh, some frustration and minor hand injury um, resulting from the fact that I didn't deburr the uh, edges of the base. Uh, we've got most of the support material removed. Now let's, let's do some sanding to clean it up the rest of the way. And then we'll get some paint on here. This is the one I'm going to start with. I'm going to paint the um, energy, the fists, these little squares that are meant to represent energy coming off the fists, the energy coming out of the mouth, the eyes inside of the mouth. It all gets this color. I'm going to paint that first. And then we'll go from there.
the modeling helps a lot in the paint job. So rather than try to freestyle, freehand anything, I always try to model out every line. Then use that to guide the brush. We're gonna go to the base next. And I've found just personally, after trying some different things, that I like the flat black best for the bases. Even though this color, this character is mostly black, you'll be able to see the difference between the flat and the glossy pretty well. So there's still a bit of contrast. So that's what we're gonna go with next. The way these are modeled, there's a little bit of a angle down from the uh, arms to the base, actually all the appendages. And uh, I do that so I can kind of get up under there and it makes a cleaner line. Do some touch ups.
we're gonna let that dry a little bit and um, we'll take a look at it when it's done. All right, here it is, the Blastling. I hope you enjoyed the video. Thank you very much for watching and have a wonderful day.